I'm Alana, I'm an adoption specialist here at Pet Barn and this is my story. I grew up in a family where we did have lots of rescue animals, um, lots of pets growing up, birds and cats and dogs. Um, and when I was little I always knew that I wanted to work with animals, it was always a passion of mine. And at the moment I am studying to become a vet nurse, which I'm absolutely loving, helping these animals and people as well. So Pet Barn facilitates adoptions, ultimately to be able to find more animals their forever home. And we're really lucky here that we get lots of foot traffic, so lots of our customers walk past and see these animals. You can see their faces light up when they see a cat that they just have fallen in love with. And it's honestly such a nice feeling. And we run them through lots of what's involved in terms of their care, because some people haven't owned cats before, take them through getting them comfortable at home, what their daily care requires as well. And once they're sure, then we take them through the process of doing the paperwork. So the adoption process can take as little as half an hour to an hour, just depending on us doing the paperwork. Otherwise, it can take up to a day. We, we might like you to go home and think about it, um, especially if you haven't owned a cat before, just to make sure that you're completely ready for the process and you've got everything ready and set up for them at home. We know if a pet is suitable for adoption because before they come in, they are assessed for their behaviour and their temperament by the RSPCA. From there it's just a matchmaking process so we make sure that they're suitable to the home that they're going to. So if you pay for an adoption, 100% um, of the money from that goes straight back to the RSPCA. What it covers is the animals being de-sexed, they've been health checked, vaccinated and it all goes straight back to the RSPCA. In Pet Barn we have what's called our cat condos where our cats live as they're put up for adoption. So they're, they're quite good little little enclosures for them. They've got a private space for their bed and for their bathroom because lots of cats do like their privacy um, but there's also plenty of space for them to come out and meet people walking past to and potentially meet their new family. We love playing with them just like they would be played with at home. Keeps their brain active, keeps them active as well. So when somebody does decide to go through with an adoption, it's honestly the best feeling in the world um, to see them walk out with their new best friend. It's such a good feeling. So whenever they leave, like I'm a bit of a mum to them, like I, I always hope that they just settle in super well. How do I feel about the company reaching 50,000 adoptions? It is an insane number. It's crazy to think about that that many lives have been saved essentially by going into their new homes. I couldn't be prouder.